What's good, everybody? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson, back at it again with another episode of The Celebrity Junk. Black men, I want to have a serious conversation about fumbling the bag. And of course, many people do this. We've seen it in the NBA. And it's not, you know, just the players. Ime Udoka. In his 45, 46 year of life, losing his job, sleeping with people on the team. Okay? That's one thing. Then you have this, this young guy by the name of Josh Primo. First round pick last year, pick number 12. So it's almost in the lottery. Okay. Bright future. 6'6, 189 pounds. Bright future. But I want to play this clip and so we'll see what happens to him. Come on, Josh. Come on, Josh. You 19, you out here acting like you four. Out here showing your little thing like you at the playground or something. That's not going to work, man. You were in, Well, you was an NBA player. A team might pick you up, though. But you think you're Deshaun Watson or something, and you're not Deshaun Watson. The better you are, the more you can get away with. Trust me, if Josh Primo was um, DeJounte Murray and he did it, he wouldn't got cut. He wouldn't got cut. If he got cut, he got picked up like two hours later. Like, come on, man. You a knucklehead. Like, I hope you learn from this. Uh, take some classes. But, yeah, you a creep. Mental health. Yeah, get out of here. So, guys, here's here's what I want to to talk about because the guy said he didn't want to speculate but now we know why Josh Primo was exposing himself to women on the team and you know what I mean by exposing himself okay to female employees on the Spurs organization now, she has hired an attorney, whoever the lady is, right? Tony Busby. Tony Busby, if you don't know who he is, he's the lawyer that has represented the women in sexual misconduct lawsuits against Deshaun Watson. And here's a conversation that we need to have as black men. I want to talk about it because it's important. Why am I talking about this, guys? Number one, you have worked very hard to get to where you're at. Very hard. You work very hard. Imagine all the hard work you've done. Some of you've caught the bus. Things like that. Right? You've you've studied long hours. You've put in multiple times to be the master of your industry. And then there's some woman at your job that you just can't get away from. Booty's looking so nice, huh? Breasts are sitting so nice, huh? And and for you to talk to her, you know what has happened to other guys. You know it. You're not dumb. You've seen what's happened to guys before. But you know what? You are think you're special because you are, right? No, Nobody is as special as you. You're going to go ahead and do something different. And you know what? Because you're so special, she's not going to tell on you. Right? Because you're a Mac. She's not going to tell on you, right? Not you. Because you're the truth. So you're overconfident. Because you can sneak and hit that in. And, 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 and send her the D pictures and you're not going to get caught and your, your girlfriend ain't going to know your wife ain't going to know a, a, until, until boom then they know and then you fall victim to the same people that you used to make fun of your goddamn self and then you used to say when you hear stuff like that how could they be so stupid until it becomes you until it becomes you, then you have put everything in jeopardy that you have worked for, man. Everything. 
Everything in jeopardy. You've worked so hard to do as an idiot, as a dummy, as somebody stupid. You have risked all of that. This is how you take care of your mom, some of y'all. It's how you take care of your kids, some of y'all. This is what you do. Okay? You lose everything for somebody who don't give a damn about you. And to be honest, the person don't even look that good. Why'd you go and send them that picture? We don't know. We don't know. Why'd you go and try to talk to them? We don't know. Was it that serious? No. Are you that stupid? Yes. Now everybody laughing at you and you mad. You mad. You mad and it's your fault that you mad. It's your fault. You could have went and got you somebody else somewhere else. Now look at you. You're 19 years old. You, 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 you're six foot six. You might not ever get back in the league again at 19 because you are a hassle. You're a lawsuit waiting to happen for a basketball player. And guess what? You haven't even given yourself the time to be good. Not even. Bro, at least give yourself time to become a superstar before you do something stupid. No, be a 19-year-old thirsty person. Take your ass right back to Canada. Be completely dusty and have nothing. Because once you have spent 20 years in the NBA and you lose your job, what you going to do now? What are you going to do now? What are you going to do? You always labeled as something like that. You know, you're that guy now. You know, you want to show yourself to, 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 to girls and everything like that, which is, which is so dumb, which is dumb. It don't even make no sense. It's stupid. Guys, you work too hard to get there. Don't let nobody take it away from you. Because you are thirsty. How desperate can you be for for sex? Right? These ladies are going to tell, man. If you mess with them, they're going to tell. If you have if 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 you try to expose them, they're going to tell, especially if they're a part of big time organs where they can sue you and sue the business. Like the Spurs, like the Celtics, oh man. Bro, if you're going to mess up for yourself, do at, at least with Deshaun Watson, at least none of the stuff he did it with, I don't think, was with anybody. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to basically check that out. But at least the stuff he was doing, he wasn't trying to sleep with people at the job. He at least was not that dumb. Some of the brothers that I'm seeing are not that bright. Please don't do it to yourself, brother. Don't do it to yourself. So, guys, what do you think? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson. Back at it again. Another episode of The Celebrity Jump. Appreciate you for all that you do. Subscribe at the bell. We're out.